Hello kittens. Hello mama. How you doing pretty girl? You want more food, don't you? This is just going to be a visit, not setting up, just because I want to go to Bed Bath & Beyond and look for a type of towels without boots. Mm -hmm. Hold on guys, let me open the door and sit down. Do not escape. You're escaping. I mean, I mess with your food, Mom. Orion's tail spot is getting more pronounced. You'll have to excuse me for not laying in the kennel today. Kittens have started peeing. And I know Ziggy peed right here yesterday. Let's see. Okay. You layer it up. Looks like they're using this corner over here. That's good. Not recently. Ooh, I have no idea which cam is live. I can't check. So I will treat both as being live. Don't worry, Mama. I will feed you again. The electrical plug I tried putting in the upstairs bathroom, hallway bathroom, did not work. So I'll pick up a pick up a different style soon and try again tonight. Turn. It seems like this house. I've heard last night of other houses being wired the same way. Where there's two circuits going into every room. And the circuit that controls the plug in the bathroom controls the master bedroom. The circuit that controls the lights in the, in the hallway bathroom controls this room. I guess the reasoning behind it is that if a circuit goes bad, no room is completely left without power. But it makes a pain in knowing which circuits to kill to kill power to the entire room. So that's something I'll have to do later to map out circuitry. I'll put a uh, like a night light in every plug or in every wall socket, and then test it that way. Start cutting the switches one by one and see what goes out. I already did a blueprint for my house, and I can use that to diagram the electrical.
You guys like to dig at the towels. This is why I need to find a towel with no loops. These are cheap Walmart towels. Towels. And the claws snag on the loops. I'll be happy to pay more for a towel that I can use longer. <laughs> Look at you, right? Oh, both of you are underneath the towel. I hope you. I hope now that this cat is live here, so you can see that. Chris. Water. No iPad from my bed. Too late. <laughs> oh well. It's okay. If she hurt you, it's a little bit in here. Yeah, she just said, uh, she's not comfortable yet with two people coming in. Oh, looks like she's better now. So, you let them crawl on you now? Yep. You're going to fall. We'll do the plug tonight. Okay. The one that's downstairs is not the style I like. I had to bring this to me because they're both climbing underneath the tunnel, but they, of course, they stopped, and of course, they couldn't see it. Okay, thank you. There may be more beeps tonight, but I may just turn off the UPS and put a lamp next to the cage. You guys want to go under again? <laughs> Ziggy and I think Spock went underneath the towel here. Uh -oh. That's Spock. Okay, thank you. Ow. Sharp claws, sharp claws. Spock seems to like being held against my chest. Oh, he's going up. 
He's going to He's going to be a coin art. How about you, Maggie? Maggie, you're Ziggy. Shark claws. You like being held to? Oh. I love jeans, not the shirt. Ziggy's digging again. She's chewing on the towel. Orion likes to be held too. Yay. You guys are going to make somebody a awesome pet. Even you, Mama. <laughs> what you doing, Zigster? You gonna empty the tank for us over there? She's got the zoomies. Okay, let's practice your zoomies over here. You guys are going to be trouble. Cute, adorable, trouble. Where he's climbing now, I have a plastic sheet attached keep their claws from being able to, well, basically keep them from climbing, because that's how previous kittens have gotten onto the shelf up here. And the shelf is pushed up against the fence here, so they can't go up through behind it, as previous kittens have done. He's trying. You got two rungs up off the ground. Here, this is, you can see him better here. Look, now we got two climbers. You only can see one on each cam.
You stepped out just a fart, didn't you, Mom? Focus. Thank you. When I release the kittens, that cam is going to be moved or unplugged and another cam used in its place. I'll keep this cam back here up. At least that's the current plan. Yeah, because you the outside cam you'll be able to see through the door. Okay, it's your brother's turn. Maggie, I mean, Ziggy, look at you being all cute and upside down stuff. I put you down and immediately you go up the wall. Ryan just climbed up onto my shoulders. Mama's watching him. Ambush. Okay, have a good day. Sun's heading off to work. Okay, I'm going to quit switching cams. I'm just going to turn the other cam on the pit.
You are such a pretty girl, both of you. Two girls, two boys. If anyone is seriously considering adopting Roz, one thing to keep in mind is that she will be nervous in your home for probably about a week. I would recommend keeping her isolated to one room. Let her get used to being in that one room before allowing her to expand throughout the rest of the house. She will be more nervous than the kittens will be. But she, once she relaxes, she'll be the sweetest soul and soul that you will have ever adopted. Probably. Are you beating up my hand? Ow. She's raking her claws across them, across my hand. Ow! <laughs> she bit my finger. And she's getting sharp and stronger. Okay, Ziggy, let's wind you up. Okay. Go! No, 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 no. You're supposed to go. Uh oh. I think she's about to literally go. This way. My tummy, tummy's gurgling. Mom could hear it. <laughs> Go ahead and start feeding her. Now, for those that have seen me weigh the weigh the food, that was mostly for my own amusement to see how much food she's eating. But it's a good uh, learning point too because mom eats between one and two pounds of food a day, and she needs that just to take maintain her own weight while nursing the kittens. Zoomies. <laughs> Jesus, Orion. <laughs> you keep running into the fence. <laughs> Guys act like he just pooped or something. Guess my winding them up was a delayed reaction. Basically, just to maintain her kittens, take so much out of her that just to maintain her own weight, she has to eat one third of it every day. It's 
like six cans. A normal cat would be getting fat off of this. Or a, a normal cat being a non nursing cat. Okay, kittens, I'm going to step out now, so I want you to behave for your mama. Ryan feels a lot heavier. There's a toy mouse on the scale, which I did not put there. Oh, lost my balance. There we go. Enjoy the kittens. Have a nice day.